Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how can we report on knowledge articles which are applied to a specific incident or any other task. For that, we will create a report in ServiceNow from scratch. If you don't know how to create reports in ServiceNow in depth, please click on the top right corner. Let's quickly jump to ServiceNow. I'm in ServiceNow and I will create a new report. I will give the name of the report knowledge articles applied and for that we will have to use a table called knowledge applied to tasks and the backend name of the table is m2m underscore kb underscore task and then you will click on next and then we will get a report of the knowledge articles and the related task or incident which are attached to it. And if I click on next and next, we will be able to see who are the users who have attached those KB articles to those incidents as well in updated by. And now for example, if I go to an existing incident, which is ending with 7001 and I will attach a KB article in this. For example, I will attach employee referral policy knowledge article here and I will get a confirmation message that details of employee referral policy have been added to additional comments. And if I quickly refresh this page, I should be able to see the knowledge article under related records. Now if I go back to my report, a new record should be added with that incident number and if I run this again and if we look at the last record, a new record has been added to the knowledge applied to task table. Similarly, if we attach any knowledge article to any change problem or any table which is derived from task table all those records should be reflected here and you can report on those and now if you want to sort these with respect to users you can apply a group by under configure and we can do group by updated by and it will show me all the users together which are like for example admin who has attached the kb article to these incidents will appear in a group Further, if we want to apply any filter, we can do that as well by choosing updated by and then I can give the username for which I have to search and I will click on run here and I should be able to see only two KB articles in this report. For example, if you want to run it for your group, then you can actually search with your updated by and the team members name by using or. I hope this video was helpful to you. Let me know in comments if you have any questions. Please do subscribe to my channel. Thank you.